to my channel, my name is David. Today is kind of a crappy day outside. I might as well just do some stuff in the house. I got plenty to do. What I'm going to be doing today is opening up some packages with you guys. Most of the stuff I got is basically just my consultainment center. Since now I'm getting to the very end, installing my very last consoles. Uh, I picked up a, quite a few stuff though. So as you can see here, uh, I picked up a lot of stuff. Not that it should be a surprise to anybody, but anyways. These are all things that's related to uh, what I got going on for my consultainment center. So I hope you guys are doing good. Uh, it's like uh, uh. it's like 8 30 in the morning i already went up for my coffee I, I got up at like 6 30 my dog woke me up it's like having an infant in the house my wife is up so my dog's been waking us up really early don't know why lately um this is actually like Saturday, so last night I went to bed like 11 30. Oh my god, so ladies, who I can stay the up hell too. <laughs> so, cares? anyways, let's just open some shit up. <laughs> All right, so what I want to do is I want to start off with what I picked up at the store. So, this week I ended up going to, uh, I'm sure you, everybody's heard of it. Uh, it's a place called Family Dollar. The name is very deceiving. There's a lot of stuff that's pretty much, there's almost nothing in it that's a dollar. Picked up these military shorts. Of course, oh, it's got all my colors. Um, I picked these up like big because I like to have them like bigger and longer. And I don't like my butt to be crunched in there so I can't move. So, uh, I don't think they were cheap. I mean, basically they were 14 bucks. They were like $2 less than what Walmart would have charged. Quality is. A, is you know, it's okay. It's not bad. I noticed they didn't put a belt in it. Usually you get a belt with these things, but I guess that's one of the cost saving ways. But now I have a nice pair of shorts that I'm going to try to keep, you know, separate so I can actually go somewhere with shorts on. What I want to do is I want to start off with this one that I've already opened. This one I opened because I had to take something out for my wife or my daughter. So that's why I'm starting with this and I'm keeping this package. So what I got here is the Hyperkin PS1. PS2 adapter. Um, I gotta replace one of the ones that I have over there right now. Uh, this is actually gonna go, I think it's for my PS1, one, one of them. It's gonna go to one of them. Um, the other thing I picked up is, this is actually pretty interesting. It's gonna be a laughing stock, tell you the truth. PCI Express card with a parallel port and a serial port, nine pin serial port. Now, most of you are saying, what the frick? That's no, bullshit! No, no, no. no, listen to this, okay? I have this old, uh, something similar. Most of you hardcore gamers out there will remember the uh, Dex drive where you could take your saves and you could actually pop them into the computer and save them onto floppies or just save them onto your hard drive or whatever. Well, here I have this very similar to a Dex drive. I mean, it's probably, I wouldn't be surprised if it was reverse engineered that I picked up at EB Games so so long ago when they were going like you know they were cleaning up the place like crazy this thing cost me like four or five bucks I paid for this brand new in the box and I already downloaded it took me a while to find I cannot find the original disc so what I did is I went online and I found the original driver from some website so I have that I tried using a USB cable you know um, you know parallel port to USB converter but it, it didn't work let's start with this guy right here Alright, so if you guys remember, uh, by the time you guys see this video, you've already saw the other one. Uh, I bought this open box on Amazon from my TurboGrafx-16. This is another Hyperkin product right here. So I tried to buy the cheaper one, the open box. That bitch was actually broken. The freaking D-pad was just flapping around. I really wanted to buy just one. I know, I mean, I didn't want to spend a $20, but my, my controller broke on my TurboGrafx-16. Um, I unplugged it from the console and the whole connector just came right out. Go through the next one right here and I'll show what this is this looks like I bought it on eBay oh cool cool so what I got here is this adapter I paid uh, $12 for this on eBay it was like somebody was selling it for 15 and I sent an offer for $12 and 25 cents and the guy accepted and took it uh, what is a retro bit it's a wireless receiver Bluetooth you can use any type of Bluetooth controller you want on this I do have the original wireless controller that came with the Genesis but I was curious to buy this and see if I can use uh, another controller because this apparently you can use anything switch controller ps4 or Xbox one and you know Bluetooth is just a better transmission rather than the old RF so if this turns out really good and I can find Bluetooth version of the Sega Genesis control even if it's an aftermarket as long as the build quality is good I will be return I will be selling my original Sega Genesis RF controller since there isn't many of those flopping around I should at least make my money back it's a Sega official licensed product and retrobit makes really good stuff 
I really look forward to this and I, I just love the fact that you can use the exact you can use the the same you know hardware with modern technology attached to it gaming edition of on my unboxing stuff like I said it's just been like something that's just been going on in my head everything's just all about gaming and shit lately so I plan on getting a little bit better when it comes to those types of like uh, trying out stuff reviewing things still trying to learn how to do the, the split screen on my editing software so eventually I'll get better with that but for the most part I just want to say thank you to everybody for watching this video I hope you guys enjoy my content and I want to say thank you to all my new subscribers so I'll see you guys in the next one thank you so much don't forget to enjoy life love life and don't forget to be kind peace I am a prodigy I am a leader they follow me